Hello everyone, Lorenzo here from RVT. RVT. Um, so it's been about a couple of weeks now. Um, our, by the way, <laughs> this is, I know I told you at last, last video that I was going to uh, go to the other two hives over there, which they're doing fine. You know, I already checked them and uh, there's nothing to see there. The only thing that I did to those two hives, hive number one, uh, hive number two and number three, is that I... Um, added the two frames that I took out from hub number one uh, I added the two frames with honey in it in them and um, since it is we're in October now uh, September is when they start getting you know when we start having a drought here and it starts getting kind of like fall looking so you can see the, the trees are still green and some of the leaves are falling down, but usually the the tree line over there starts looking like orangey and yellowish and stuff like that, and some red. It looks really nice. I love the fall. I don't know why, but I love the fall. It's my favorite time of the year. Um, but uh, back to this, the I took some. Um, oh, there's some bees in there. I brought them from the other side. Probably don't, does, doesn't know how to get out. But anyways, I brought some uh, those two frames. I put them on frame number uh, high number two and three. And uh, so today we're gonna check on hive number one again. Like I said earlier, uh, there's a lot of traffic going in and out through there. Um, and see how they did, you know, because it was full of uh, high beetle last time I checked. I put some mints on there. So we're going to check to see how those mints are doing, see if they're worth doing it again or if I need to look uh, uh, something somewhere else to see if I can uh, fix the high beetle uh, issue that we're having here in hive number one. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and set up and uh, uh, get my gear on and check on them and see how they're doing. Alright. Here we are, hive number one. Get my second glove on. I, earlier I saw some bees flying over here. I hope they're not robbers, you know, trying to get into the hive. And I'm over here about to open it. See some hive beetles here. Not that many, I only saw three. Three here. Two care of them. So three, three hives so far. Uh, last time I opened this up, it was, it was bad. <laughs> There's some smoke on this side. All right. that is but it's not a bee so oh hi beetle yep 
Yep, they're right here. They're hiding between the uh, frames. Not between the frames, between the uh, the outside of the frame and it was just one of them, but just came out. I see no high beetles on the on the outside plate. I think I just matched one. Yeah, I see high beetle steel right here on this frame. Let me get my high beetle killer. No bueno. See some high beetles right away on this frame right here. So we're gonna start picking at them. If this frame is empty, I'm going to go ahead and remove it. I see some uh, Hopefully we'll be able to remove a lot of them here. Looks like the, the bees are going are going wild because of these high beetles. Yeah, I don't know why the bees don't, uh, they just, sometimes they just go around them, you know, like. All right, this frame is free, a beetle. I think I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and take this frame. There's only honey on one side. So. Take this frame, give them some less space because these beetles are horrible. One thing I did notice is where I put the mints right here on the corner from last time. There were not any high beetles there. Hold on, let me take my sunglasses. I don't know why I have my sunglasses on. It was sunny earlier actually. The sun is just... Not there anymore, so there's no point of having my sunglasses on and hard to see in there. Oh I see some hot fighting in there. I see two bees fighting. It's probably uh trespassers. So I'm just gonna look, uh, go through them like real quick. I'm not gonna go too deep into it because they might be getting robbed right now. And 
I don't want to spend a lot of time trying to capture this dang beetles this time of year. Where the beetle go? You know, it's uh, sometimes you know, I go back and watch these, these videos while I'm editing, and then I see the beetles crawling on the outside of the, or the box, and I'm like, oh man. How can I didn't see that one? <laughs> so now I'm like constant, constantly looking at the uh, outside of the hive. Oh, go on the other side again. Because it looks like they, they know. These beetles know. It's like I'm on their side. They go to the other side. Oh yeah, the sun came out. I can see better through that. Even though it's hot, you know, when the sun comes out, I'd rather have it hot than not be able to see inside the cells. Okay, this, this one is clear. They do have honey on both sides, but... Um. Oh, that's a bee. <laughs> All right. Remove some of those propolis. All right, so I've got some high beetles right here. I'm gonna brush off. I hope I'm still recording because, oh man, I got some bees on the in the process. But anyways, I, I hope I'm still recording because it's been kind of hot right now. And my, yeah, it does. And my camera shuts off. <laughs> Yeah, I don't see any hot beetles here. This side. I'm just gonna put it back. Um, let me remove one of the uh, frames with root. See how they're doing on the Bruce department. I 
see some larvae in there. I mean, it's not crazy. It's not too crazy. I took one of the bees out, one of the larvae, to see how they're doing, and she's doing, I mean, I don't know if y'all can see it, um, but I took one of them out, and she looks great, so. I'm just going to put them back, and it looks like they're doing pretty good, there's brood, um, making sure that there's no diseases going on, or anything like that. Um, so everything was good. I just beheaded one of the bees, but all right, I'm gonna put him back. They're looking good. I don't see any foul brood or anything like that. So that's good. I took uh, one of the frames to uh, give them more space to the, less space, I mean, so they can de defend the hive because, you know, it's the time of the year where bees get robbed and I don't want no shenanigans like that happening and with less space to defend they have better success going around my house no shenanigans <laughs> I was just talking and then that came out so that's weird all right so put some of that propolis out so I can better seal this stuff in You know what? They're not too they're not being too defensive. So that's that's a good thing. Unless if I just haven't been paying any attention to them since I was busy with the high beetles. Oh, I see my my wife came out from the house inspecting the uh my work here. See what I'm doing, I guess. <laughs> she's, she took a nap and and now she's out there, probably seeing what I'm doing. I was knocked out while she was taking a nap. She's been sick, so I didn't want to bother her. All right. Oh shoot! I just had a fatality. Ah, I'm gonna smoke it. Get it in there so I can smell it. Oh, you know what? I don't know if 100% if this is working or not, but for the sake 
of you know because I'm pretty sure I didn't get them all last time I was here and and they should have actually gotten out already by now but I'm gonna put some more mints I'm gonna put some more mints in here so hopefully that uh, I should have put I, sh I should have gotten one on the other side too a couple of them on the first frame when I was looking at it when I opened it uh, I didn't think about it I don't want Ah, oh, this candy is so hard to open, especially when your gloves are all sticky. All right. Oh my God. This propolis is not letting me. It went all the way down. I want it all the way down. Here's a fatality. I didn't get any comments from the last time that I was asking about this propolis. So. Guess the only thing that there's to do with the propolis is do uh, tincture. That's it. What I know. <laughs> or maybe I'm just wasting my breath and making this video so people can can hate me. <laughs> Which, you know, it doesn't matter to me. I can deal with that. My job, my full time job, a lot of people hate me, so it doesn't affect me one way or another. Alright, so this is getting out of control over by my tractor. I think we have a lot of bees that are robbing now. So, I'm gonna end this video. Because we have a lot of bees over here by the tractor. Because of that frame that I took out. So you can see. Because I'm busy in there. So I better move it away from here. Here's the other frame. I'm gonna go ahead and put this frame in there. I just put it right here for now. You can see over here they're like robbing it now. I don't know if my wife wants that. I might go ask her. Anyways, <laughs> it's not much, but see, look at that. So that's gonna be it for this video. Uh, just make sure you like and subscribe. If you don't mind, I would really appreciate that. They're doing good. Fruit is good. So we got another frame, giving less space. Trying to prepare them for winter. And uh, like I say, you know, make sure you like and subscribe and. If you want to see me preview for YouTube, sometimes I put pictures on Instagram. Uh, so make sure you follow me there if you don't mind. I really appreciate it. And that's it. Thank you for watching.